Arcade Heroes. This is Adam with Arcade Heroes at IAPA 2021, checking out the Raw Thrills and Betson booth. Now, I'm not going to be doing any individual filming of these games since I've already got a bunch of footage already, but just show you the booth. So this is probably the headline of the booth right now, King Kong VR. But they've got plenty of their other games, such as Superbikes 3, always in a nice sparkly cabinet. Got Nitro Trucks, which didn't get quite the fair shake because it was introduced at IAPA 2019, and so that was right before the pandemic, but it's here now to enjoy. I'm sure the software's been updated a little bit since we last saw it. But let's get a moment of this here and see. It does look nice and plays fine. And the cabinet is a little bit like the cruising cabinet, although I don't remember this thing on the back from previous versions. Um, over here we got Injustice, Big Buck Reloaded. Uh, next with a custom, we'll squeeze through so here. He told me earlier, so if I get my number. Right. Got Apple Industries over there, photo booth company. Got Nerf Arcade. Got Bust a Move Frenzy. This is another game that also didn't really get a nice fair shake on the market because it came out in February 2020. <laughs> uh, but it's Bust a Move. Or Puzzle Bobble, if you know it by that name. But instead of using a joystick to shoot the bubbles, you use your guns. So this is uh, similar in design to the Space Invaders Frenzy or the Nerf Arcade and this kind of say share the same ideas as far as the seating and control panel go. But this is done on Raw Thrills' giant LED screen, which was also used for Space Invaders Frenzy and uh, World's Largest Pac-Man that they did for Namco. We got Halo Fireteam Raven, the deluxe version. Haven't seen the super deluxe four-player version in a while, but this has been out for a couple of years, so good chance you've already seen it, and I have footage of it. And last but not least, Minecraft Dungeons Arcade, which of course I have. I have a lot of direct footage of this on my channel, so at least as far as that goes, we've seen it a bunch. But I do need to get some new uh, card holders because mine have been trashed. Uh, so just waiting on those to arrive. But yeah, that's Raw Thrills. As they mentioned to me before the show, they were not planning on bringing any new stuff because right now shipping is a bit of a nightmare and there's production delays and things of that nature. So because of that, um, they're going to wait to show new, new, new stuff at uh, Amusement Expo 2022. But uh, that's Raw Thrills for IAPA 2021. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you on the next video.